An Air France Airbus A350 suffered a tail strike during a go-around in Toronto on Sunday. While go-arounds are common, they shouldn't result in tail strikes. Fortunately, no one was injured, and the plane was able to land safely around 15 minutes later. Now the questions are how long it'll take to fix this plane and what the cause of this was. What do you make of this Air France Airbus A350 incident? The aircraft was attempting to land on runway 24L at 4.34 p.m., though the pilots decided to perform a go-around, which is supposed to be a standard and safe procedure. The pilot told the air traffic controller that the decision was made to perform a go-around due to a long landing, which is when there's not enough room to stop anymore or it's beyond the company's operating policies. A plane spotter even captured the exact moment of the tail strike, where you can see sparks coming from near the tail. Based on the video footage from inside the cabin where you can see the runway markers, it appears that the aircraft landed at around the 600 meter mark and the runway is 2,756 meters long. However, something obviously went very wrong there because the jet suffered a tail strike during this maneuver. Vase Aviation has a recreation of the incident showing both the A350's position as well as the air traffic control audio. What I really can't wrap my head around based on the above video is how the aircraft touches down, then the pilots seem to pull the nose up, and then the pilots seem to apply power, which doesn't seem like the right order in which to do things. I'm curious if the pilots even realize they had a tail strike. They seem a bit distracted in their communication following the go-around and also don't advise the air traffic controllers of the tail strike. It's interesting how the tail strike marks are off-center suggesting that the plane was banking to some degree while it was performing a go-around, which is an additional detail that's confusing, I'm sure, that an investigation will be performed into why this happened to prevent a similar occurrence in the future. It'll be interesting to see what that uncovers.